Okay. What's up? What up? What up? What up? <laughs> what up? <laughs> oh, <wow>. <laughs> <laughs> Please, can you sing that every week? <laughs> hey. Hi. Welcome back to the Chanto. My name is. What? <laughs> I do it every time. <sighs> My name is Luke. My name is Deepa. And we watch Doctor Who. We are watching series nine, episode twelve. Hell Damn. bent. Yeah, I don't like the sound of that at all. <laughs> Stressful, a bit emotional. Okay. Because you know he's going back home. Yeah, Gallifrey. And you know it's been a while. Yeah. Shall we do this? Yeah. <laughs> No. No, but yes. But yes. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm scared. I'm scared. No. <laughs> we both just went into that. No communication. <laughs> Snacks and gas. <laughs> Where do you get the car from? Yeah. It's not quite how I expected the episode to start. No. No. Is that Carla? <laughs> what can I get you? I think that it's called Clara. Tell me about her. imagining her. I, I hate, love I when, like, that you know. I, like yeah, I love when the openings are just like not at all what you no. want. It's like you start this one like, yeah, Gallifrey! Yeah, and then and you I'm just like, open oh. in a cafe with Clara. Yeah. Sorry? It's not Clara, for sure. We know <laughs> that. It's either his imagination or a Time Lord dressed up as Clara. Dressed up. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Buckle Mars. <laughs> Mars. <laughs> Is there life on Mars? Mm -hmm. Did you know that song? No. <laughs> <laughs> Funny they know that he's a doctor even though he's changed so many times. Yeah. They just know. They were well aware. It's music. <laughs> the drama. Who the hell does he think he is? The man who won the time war, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Feels like I'm watching like a medieval drama. Yeah, doesn't it? Get off my planet. We needed to know. Do you know what I have out here? No witnesses. Wait. Take aim! On my command! Ah! Oh. Wasn't expecting that. Could I have a lemonade? Doctor. They never do a fade out. I know. Oh, Clara again. Oh. I have to watch that again. <laughs> Death 
is an established historical event and cannot be altered. I'm sorry. Doctor, will you just talk to me? But she needs to die. Yeah, they need to put her back. They pulled her out the moment just before yeah. for her help, but they are going to have to put her back yeah. at some point. But yeah. what's he doing? He's attached. He's attached. Yeah, he just doesn't want to let her go. Yeah, but like, you see what happens if he... I don't know. Well, and that person who he gave another life to. Yeah, didn't end very well, did it? End well, but... Did you shoot him? I just don't get what he's doing now. He's unhinged. The doctor's just been a bit of an umpty. He's unhinged at this point. I think it was spending all that time in the castle. <laughs> I think that makes sense. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna turn violent though. <laughs> oh, it's on sad. It does, isn't it? And he's saying he's saying, oh my god, that's a weak angel. The Time Lords have a lot of stuff. Oh my god, it went! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Luke. No. <laughs> Yeah. All the cameos. <laughs> oh my god, no! <laughs> that was all a bit too much for me. Yeah, sorry. It was all the things you hated most oh, in one god. scene. Tell me what happened to the doctor. Oh, she knows. She knows. Okay. Trapped inside the confession bell. Four and a half billion years. Four and a half billion years. That's a long time, isn't it? I was dead. Because you are hated. <clears throat> They're quite friendly. You. Yeah, oh, as time lords go. Don't worry, Doctor. They'll all be looking at me. Slow. You need to tell us what the Doctor is going to do now. What do you think he's going to do now? <laughs> the and away. Oh, that look like the one I know of. No. She hasn't got a heartbeat. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why I do that. Look, cut him some slack. Right, four, <laughs> four and a half billion years. <laughs> Checking it properly. This should work. This has got to. What if one last heartbeat's all I've got? How can there be anybody there? Oh my god, four I would knocks. not answer that. That was four knocks. They need a ring bell. <laughs> I told you once that the universe would become a very small place and I'm angry with you. Hello, me. You don't seem surprised to see me. I mean, the end of the really? universe looks alright. Yeah. I thought there'd be fire, like yeah. lots of fire. I think everywhere. it's all like happened already. I think this is like the ash of it all. The hybrid. I think it's time to tell the truth. Yeah, like what is this hybrid nonsense? Like, Honestly. Come on now. What if the hybrid wasn't one person, but two? Of a passionate and powerful time lord and a young woman so very similar to him. How did you meet her? Missy. Missy. The master. The lover of chaos. Clara's my friend. And you're willing to risk all of time and space because you miss her. I'm going to wipe a memory of every last detail of me. It'll be like our friendship never happened. It's been <laughs> I love it, sunglasses. <laughs> it's like really serious scenes and then she just whacks <laughs> the sunglasses on. When you wake up, you'll have forgotten me. You'll have forgotten we ever even met. And why would I want that? I use these. What? What did you do? What do you think? Push that button.
Martin Doctor, it will go off in your own face. Trick. What are you trying to do to me? I'm trying to keep you safe. Why? I don't think I could ever forget you. Came the hybrid. This is right. I accept it. So this is gonna wipe his memories of her. Charles Yeah. That was traumatic. <laughs> I know we travelled together. She's I know that home. there was a nice warrior on a submarine and a mummy on the Orient Express. She could be me, for all you know. There's one thing I know about her. If I met her again, I would absolutely know. I think Amy and Rory. It was Amy and Rory. Very much. Very much. The outer shell might be stuck as an American diamond. Awesome. Still low pulse. If I go back to Gallifrey, they can put me back, right? On Trap Street, the moment they took me out. Of course. The long way around. <laughs> <laughs> Flying a little diner around. Love that. That's a TARDIS we know. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Got a new Sonic. <laughs> Love that. Oh, gosh, I could do that. I know, it's cool, isn't it? All the little flakes. <laughs> oh my god, I feel like Whoa. I I I just have more questions. More questions. That often happens at a finale. I mean like what an episode. A lot happened. But like my brain I feel like it's been a while since my brain has been that frazzled yeah. watching Doctor Who. Because I remember like when I first started watching Doctor Who, like my brain was just always frazzled. And like, I feel like it has been on? a while, but I don't yeah. think I've realised until I've got that until feeling. Like, yeah. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> That really was a frazzle. So what 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 do you want to talk about? Because there is a few things we need to talk about. Do you want to talk about like the hybrid? The hybrid. Yeah. Yeah. I don't understand how the Doctor and Clara together now are they're a hybrid. Yeah. I so thought a hybrid was half Dalek. Half one. Yeah, that was the like. I think the else. time time lords. Yeah. The time lords and the Daleks just presumed that right. because they love themselves so much they just presume that the hybrid would be half of them but a but hybrid actually, is also a shielder she is a hybrid of sorts for sure yeah yeah, yeah. So there are a lot of hybrids so to be fair yeah nothing was really confirmed a lot of it was just like them theorizing of what they think the hybrid could be but i think the conclusion that they <coughs> came to <are> you okay <coughs> did it go down the wrong hole yeah and it's the stress of the show <laughs> I think the, the the strongest theory that they had was the Doctor and Clara together being a Time Lord and a human. They like, the whole of series nine, it's kind of been a subtle thing, I don't know if you've like picked up on, but they like, they push each other really far and they make each other do like ridiculous things. It's kind of been subtle, I have to I say. I don't think I've noticed that, but yeah. I, I have always been like, yeah. what are they doing? Yeah. Like, he should be taking care of her For and sure. like, they are, you know... I feel of... like I've always thought that about Doctor Who, though. I don't know yes. if it's just them two. But... Yes, true. He does put a lot of people in danger. Yeah. And vice just, versa. Like, but I think it? Clara enjoys it too much, I think. Yeah. When Danny died, yeah. And then she's just like, right, back, back we go. That was it, I think, which is like series nine. I think she kind of felt like she had nothing to lose. And so mm. she went a bit like far with it all. And that's where I think the hybrid sort of comes into it. And a lot of it is like how far the Doctor went to save her. Like He obviously knows that if like it's written in time and someone dies you can't change that like that's been hammered into us like Since throughout series all the one. series yeah and then it's like obviously with the shielder he fucked up yeah and you know look what happened it oh, kind of yeah. caused clara's death in a way it did it and sort then, of did and then he learned no lessons and it's just like come on what are you doing like yeah. i didn't as sorry as i felt for him for like being trapped in that place for like four and a half billion years yeah it was kind of like you, sh you, you should, should know, know better Come yeah on now. and i think that's in a way why he was able to accept forgetting about her because he was like i have to move on mm. from this or yeah. i'm gonna fuck myself up because even clara herself said look you can't yeah 
it's too much. Yeah. I think that's the hybridness of it all is that the hybrid goes too far um, and is willing for time to like be destroyed. And I think he was willing for that to happen for a bit. But you could say anyone's a hybrid in you a could. way. Like, there's not you actually could. an explanation of what a hybrid there's is. There's no full evidence. They're some people love that, some around. people hate it. Yeah. yeah, I'm not a fan. Not a fan. It's just a bit like everyone's going on about the hybrid for so long yeah. and then it's like you've not actually explained it yeah. it yeah. could just be what you think it is yeah interpretation yeah do you not like that not with the hybrid no <laughs> not some, with the hybrid some things yeah but yeah. there's just you not wanted with a the clear hybrid. answer yeah I did yeah, that's fair and I thought everyone on Gallifrey would be like awful worse like I literally thought he was going to turn up There'd be fire everywhere. Yeah. Everyone would be like trying to kill him. Yeah. Constantly. Yeah. It would be like war. Yeah. I thought that's what would happen. Like war yeah. would break, break out. Break out. I think the fact he got rid of the president and the council so early on kind of mm. helped him get rid of the people who were going to do that sort of thing. I think mm. he swooped in before. Oh, he no. he was a man on a mission today, <clears throat> that doctor. God. And like, yeah, he was how desperate for long-winded? Clara. Yeah. Like, I can't believe all of that happened. Yeah, just so he could be with his best friend. Just to get Clara back. Yeah. Like, we had episodes leading up to just this one bit. Thing, yeah. That's kind of mad. Crazy, isn't it? And then, like, it was just like, we all like, looked at the doctor like, what are you doing? What are you doing, hon? Yeah. Like, need babe, nap. stop now. <laughs> it was kind of for the best he lost his memory. For sure. In the weirdest way. He was impacted way. more than Clara. Yeah. Definitely. And he Clara, needed to forget about her. She's going to go die anyway. She is. Yeah. She's just taking her time to get there. But okay, she she's is. going the long way. Yeah. She's going to have a bit of fun with a shoulder, I guess. And then she's going to be like, right, I'm going to pop myself back and face that raven. God. And time wow. will carry what, on. What a whole what whirlwind. whirlwind. <laughs> but I don't know if you remember, but when Clara died, you were like, I just don't feel like it's the end. And I feel like a lot of people felt that way because I think this was always yeah. sort of coming. And it, it was kind wasn't... of like... A nicer goodbye, this one, in a way. I than guess her just so. Being like, deuces. Because, yeah, and I did mention it at the time, like, I felt like she was such a big character yeah. that her dying just then and there, like that, so abruptly, yeah. just, just felt like, like a bit too. Is that it? Yeah. yeah. And then, like, I guess I felt like the doctor did make up for it with his speeches yes, and things he did, like that. He did. But he um, made but up for know, it even more now, I guess. We carried on. He fought hard to get her back. Yeah. So she is a big character. <laughs> she that, does that mean a lot. That was sad that she was in that diner. And I, I was kind of sad that the doctor was still trying to find her. I yeah. wanted him to just move on. Yeah. Because that was the point of wiping his memory. Yeah. I don't want him to like cling on to her name and try like go everywhere just looking for her. her out. Yeah. yeah. Like I still think that's in a way just as bad yeah. as him remembering her. Yeah. True. Yeah. Do you know what he needs? A Christmas special. Yeah. <laughs> and then I thought he was going to regenerate. Yeah, like, I know, because he like full on looked yeah, like a doctor. I literally didn't was he? like, oh, here we go. Here we it's go. Happening. Jesus Christ. But no. But no, he's still here. Still alive and kicking. Yeah. Clara, not so much. Forks. No, not yet. Not yet. So we've done a whole series now. That's wow. series nine done. I can't believe that. I know. Nine series. Nine series of Doctor Who watched. Oh. There was Daleks. Oh my god. Oh my god. Angels. Luke. Did you you pooed that, yourself a little bit? That I I'm not gonna lie, I did. <laughs> it's been a while since you grabbed onto me. Uh, I knew it was that the Weeping Angels were gonna do it. It was that because it was like the Daleks and I was like frustrated and be yeah. like, oh you were like you know. tutting and rolling your eyes. And then like I just like moved just move past just that and then the, the weeping angel was like bam 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 and it was just like what is happening too much for you it was literally everything you hated the most in like a five second scene yeah like that was quite overwhelming <laughs> but you were really excited for that part yeah I was I built that up in my head I was like this is gonna be good then like, I thought yeah. Clara at the start was the doctor in between life and death oh uh, yeah 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 because that whole scene was like quite bright yeah, in a way, weird, like right? yeah. like he was in that in between phase. Yeah, but no, <sighs> no, <laughs> no, but no, I do like it because in the in when you watch the opening of the diner bit, when you watch it for the first time, it's she's it comes across like she doesn't know who he is, but actually when yeah. you rewatch it, it's so apparent that he has no idea who she is. Yeah, it's, it's so well like written and 
directed because yeah. when you rewatch it, it's so obvious that he doesn't know who that woman in the mm. diner is. But when you watch it the first time, you just kind of because she's like, "Oh, who's the song about? Tell yeah. me about her." You kind of think yeah. she has no idea, but so actually, you're like, oh. she's just digging to see how much he remembers. Because I was like, "Oh, that's not Clara." Then yeah, I was like so sure it wasn't her. For and sure. like Then what did I say? It was like a Time Lord dressed up as her. Yeah, I literally was. Just, I love a deeper theory. Oh, just so good. Um, oh, and a cute little, cute little fact: that the um, the bit of music he's playing on his guitar that he called Clara is actually her little theme that's been playing since series seven in the background. Really? Yeah. Do you know what? When it was playing at the end, yeah, it did feel quite familiar. like familiar and like a bit emotional in a yeah. way. Like a bit like I was just like, yeah. You've been hearing it for a long yeah, time but without I, really I, picking I, up I on it. No yeah, idea. yeah. That's she nice. actually played her character theme, which I think is well cute. That is nice. Yeah. Um, what else did I want to say? Is that everything? Yeah, probably. What do you want to rate it? Ooh. <laughs> I'm going to rate it 4.5. Me too! Stop! We're so in agreement lately. It's weird. weird. Oh, it's weird. It is weird. That's lovely. That is lovely. That is so nice. <laughs> Nine out of ten. Uh, yeah. Solid. Do you know what? The only reason why I thought it wouldn't be a five was just like the whole hybrid thing for yeah, me. Just, just wanted wasn't, a little bit more clarity. Wasn't, yeah. Um, That's fair. That was pretty much it. Like, yeah. I think there might have been like other parts of the episode that probably just weren't as strong. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's, a, it's a funny one. I've actually been on a personal journey with this episode because mm. when I first watched it, I was really anti it. I really didn't enjoy really? it. But I think I built up in my head that it was going to be like, well, sort of like you said, I was expecting like time war levels, like yeah. really pissed off time lords. And I thought, I was a bit like, it was just all about Clara and I just wanted time lords. But then like over the years when I've rewatched it and stuff I've realised that the whole fucking storyline of series 9 is about Clara yeah it so I've like come her. round to it I think I had weird personal expectations okay so when I initially watched it I was like why is it why, why are we doing this do you know what I'm glad it wasn't then, yeah for sure like I've done a complete was yeah. it 180 360 yeah, yeah. one of them yeah, 180 <laughs> done a full 180 and I really like it now and I love that it's a personal story yeah. Over explosions and fights. I and definitely that. I wouldn't have wanted Yeah. All the explosions and fights. Even I though agree. I did expect that yeah. as well. But I think it's because like every time Gallifrey is mentioned, it's like, oh, the time war. The time war. Yeah. And it's always just like all these bad Big and dramatic things happen. Yeah. So then it's like when you get there you're like, Oh. Yeah. Like it, yeah, in, in even in my head, I was a bit like, oh, was that it? Yeah. Like, they all shot but missed him, yeah. and then they put their weapons on, that's all it took. That's all it took. Like, yeah. nothing actually happened. No. So I think, yeah. yeah, there were snippets of that where I was a bit like, oh, okay. Yeah. Like, I was like, some really, bits could have been like, stronger. bombed out when I first watched it, but now I really enjoy it mm. all. I, I enjoy the little snippets of Gallifrey bits that we get, because let's move on to the emotional side of it, right? Yeah. It's all about their relationship. Yeah. But I just didn't like that on initial viewing. I was like mm. bummed out. Yeah. But I've come round to it. I fucking love Hellbent now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's Christmas. Yay! I love it. It feels like it's been a while. It has. I think it was April because we were talking about Danny Pink's message being done in April. Was that the last Christmas? Yeah. No. I think it's taken us that long to watch Series 9. Have we not had a Christmas since April? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> Leave all the spoilers for series 9 in the comments below. Yeah, so I've watched it now. Nothing about series 10 or Christmas specials, Not please. Up. But series 9, go for it. And we'll see you next week for Christmas. The snow's coming down. I'm watching it fall. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I just don't know anything you sing, Luke. Oh, my hair's a mess. <laughs>